Hello, my name is Jack, and today I'm going to show you how to kill the Wither in the most quick and efficient way. So you don't need anything too high tech for this, as long as you've got a decent sword and a decent bow, then you should be pretty sorted. You don't need any more than a stack of arrows. Uh, it's quite important to get some milk, just two or more, just in case you get withered, because then you can drink that and it will get rid of the wither effect. I've also got some blast protection iron armor. Diamond armor would obviously be better, but iron is fine, and these are all just level 1 blast protection enchantments. And of course, you also need the stuff required to build the wither, so that's three wither skulls and four soul sand. And just an iron pickaxe in order to get around. So what we're going to do is we're going to dig straight down, uh, and I'm going to press F3, and you can see my Y is currently on 61, and you just want to keep digging down until that gets to 5. Now of course there are safe ways of doing this, you could staircase down, or you could get to level 5 via cave systems, but I'm just going to do this because it's quickest. So I've now hit level 5, and what I'm going to do is just dig a big long tunnel, let's say about 30 or so blocks, just in one direction, uh, just one wide, and you want to make sure you find an area that doesn't have any lava nearby, or any cave systems, or any big clumps of gravel, because that'll just get in your way. Because basically what we're going to do is we're going to spawn the wither down here, because that is where he'll be the most contained, and you won't be able to fly around, so it'll be really easy to kill him. Okay, so I think this is about far enough. I've done a big long tunnel, and now what I'm going to do is just get a 3x3x2 three by three by area where we can build him. So if you don't know, to build the wither, all you need is these 4 blocks of soul sand, 3 wither skulls, and then you just place the soul sand like this, like you're crafting a golem, and then you put the wither skulls on top so he's got three heads and there he is so you can see his health's charging up and when he gets too full you want to get ready with your arrow and just fire straight at him so he's going to explode here we go and now we just need to repeatedly just keep firing at him um, and you just want to keep stepping back so if he fires blocks you just want to keep slowly walking backwards and you see we're getting his health down really low so he's going to be on half health now and now what we need to do is just hit him with our sword because you can no longer hit him with arrows uh, if you do get wither affected, then the best thing to do is just drink some milk. But uh, if you just keep running backwards, then hopefully that's not going to happen. So we're just going to hit him and then run away. And you see his health's getting pretty low. Keep hitting. And we haven't been withered yet, so we're doing very good. He's getting down very low. So we've been withered now, so now I'm going to do drink this milk. And I'm fine. You want to make sure you keep doing this, because otherwise... Oh, I need to drink some more milk. Okay, I'm on three hearts, so I'm going to be a little more careful now, because I don't have any more milk. But, hopefully, but thankfully, I've got plenty of food with me, so I will regen health. But it looks like we might be able to do this. I'm just going to try and get some critical hits by jumping up like this. Okay, we're almost there now. Three more should do it, I would say. Just don't run in there guns blazing, because you'll end up getting withered and blown up. Okay, one more. And there we go, and there is our nether star, so it's as easy as that ladies and gentlemen, as long as you just keep running back uh, in a nice slowly pattern, you take it easy, you calm down, you don't just run in and go, Mah! then you will be absolutely fine. So you got this nether star and now you can do whatever it is you do with them, I can't remember. Anyway guys, hope you enjoyed this tutorial, if you did then please do consider subscribing to the channel, I do a bunch of other stuff like mod showcases and mini games and all that kind of stuff. So yeah, and make sure you check out my other tutorials, there will be in the video responses. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching guys, my name's Jack, I shall see you next time. Bye!